match number two in the second round. He goes first this time, I went first last time. It's all fair. And I get a good starting hand again, but you, you always get good starting hands with this deck, really. Um, let's see. I will go turn one Vetter, and then hopefully I can get a three drop. If not, I could always just play Ranger, and then I'll go uh, Kinfolk Ranger, and then I'll go Kinfolk Wetland Ranger or Racking. I don't know what he's going to play. He's Decay. Okay, yeah. That is to be expected. BSC would obviously have a counter deck for me. Um, I don't know. What do I want here? I'm going to sacrifice the Vetter, the Vengeal Vetter, because Rumble I think is good against the K. And uh, I don't know what kind of decay is. He can't be yellow decay here to use that. He already used decay order, but I haven't seen his like really strong just like mono decay deck. So this might be that. My ass and wild. Okay, so this might be poison decay. We'll see. Wildling. Oh, Damning curse kills the wildling though. Mm. You know what? We're gonna sack the early rumble. And I'm going to hopefully it doesn't have like a brain lace or soul steel for this better. I'm gonna try to quickly kill this mass. Well, I can go ra I can go rat king next time he doesn't kill the better, and then get that thing to three attack. And hopefully destroy that mass. Well, brain lace. Okay. So you are gone, and I'm going to, tough choice, tough choice. I'm going to sacrifice the Wetland Ranger, and I'll play both of you, because I want to play Rat King next turn. And now you're Soul Steel, do I, do I attack with my eyes as well? Sure. It might all be for naught if he's like a if he's like a decay order with um he already played decay order, but I think it counts as a whole different deck if this is like decay order poison with uh Alright, you guess the infection played. And you're dead. So this would, this would count as like a different deck if he gets a um if it, if this is like summons with my Azawells. I'm gonna sack the Rat King because Ooh, I get the Oak Blood now. Do I go Oak Blood? I think I go Oak Blood in this better. That wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, let's do it. Oak Blood on you. Slowly absorb that Miasma. And I'll. But maybe I should have taken that chance to just destroy this Miasma well with the Ragged Wolf. Okay, Rod Eater in front of that. And then does he have a Darkling? Okay. Ah. Maybe I should just. Oh, you do get mag magic armor. Hmm. I'm gonna sacrifice the Fang Bear. I'm going to play the Mystic. And. I'm going to keep it at that. And I don't think this is gonna be the match where doing a ton of idle damage right now is going to. Win the game. I think we're gonna have to kill most of his creatures. I can hold off the Ragged Wolf right now because the Ragged Wolf does not kill that. So let's see. So if we lose to this deck here, we lose his uh, Decay here, Poison Decay or whatever. Um, oh, there's Blood Bear. That's gonna be a problem. If we lose, we're pro we're we don't have a. Um, we don't have a structure deck here. We used our structure deck in our first thing. So, hmm, what do I want to do here? Sagar, Ragged Wolf, Breaker, ooh. Let's go ahead and sacrifice the Breaker. And I get a wild link, good. Um, let's go ahead and put the wildling I think I'm going to have to give you up it kind of sucks 
Let's just play the wildling back here. And I already use an oak blood. Drat. Yeah, I don't like our chances this match. He, he, his deck definitely beats mine. <sighs> so, our other two decks we picked for this, um, if you don't remember, uh, from last video before the last video it showed. Um, the other two decks we picked for this deck wars, uh, this, uh, this best of five, was picked aggro growth, this is what we're playing right now. I guess the damning purse. At least I captured the miasma well. Which means you're gonna survive. That better's gonna survive. For now. For now, I say. So, I'm not too mad about that play you just made. And I could kill his Rot Eater, but I wanna kill this Blight Barrow. I think I wanna kill the Blight Barrow with a veteran. I think that's more important. As much as I wanna kill that Rot Eater, that guy has to go. I'm going to sacrifice the Stag Heart. A Rally can come in handy, Um, I probably should have drawn a champ before I did that, and I got another stack card, so maybe that was a bad play. And I'm going to go ahead and go like this. There we go. I'd much rather absorb the poison in one unit than like other units. Okay. So now there's a five attack rider, but only has two health. He has three cards and five resources. So he can't do that much this turn. But we're very worried. This, uh, as soon as he gets Maswell, this guy's dead. He did absorb that for quite a long time, and uh, that's going to make sure this guy dies without getting an attack off. This guy's not going to take any damage. Okay. Um. Hmm. I can kill both of these. Yeah. There we go. And that's it, and uh, I just have to go with a Crimson Bull or Ragged Wolf, or do I wanna, or would it work if I go Ragged Wolf, Stag Heart, no it wouldn't. Okay, let's get rid of the Stag Heart then, actually let's get rid of the Rally, and I'll sack that for cards, and I will go with the, I'll give you one extra. It doesn't matter if you're next to him. You have to be in front. Okay, whatever, let's go like this. Okay, now you're gonna die, so you can go next to the asshole well person, and I'll just take mid with you. Okay. Awesome. We cleared his board on round nine, and he has, and we have a slight card advantage, and we have the same number of resources, and we definitely have the board advantage. But his deck still is supposed to beat mine. He is, he's decay, he's poison, I'm aggressive growth. But we do have a good board state right now. But we have to look at this guy as a dead card, and this as almost dead as soon as he gets my as well. We're gonna use it until it dies. Um, another ragged wolf. I'll go ahead, I don't think I'm gonna, you're not gonna be a huge problem just yet. Minor curse on you. Let's see, do I want to draw an enchantment? I don't think I do. I think I'm just gonna play the, maybe I do, maybe I'm going to put the, uh, maybe I'm just gonna hope he doesn't have a damage curse. I'm gonna draw an enchantment. There's an oak blood. If I put it on you, that's pretty good. I'm gonna do that. Okay. Oak blood. And then, um. I'll have you two attack that idol. Move you back. Separate my guys a little bit. Not a whole lot. So now he still dies with a um with the damage curse. But we're gonna see how long that thing's gonna survive without him having a damage curse. That's the plan. 
So we hope he doesn't have a Diamond Curse in hand and he's gonna look for one and he's not gonna get one until later. Okay, does he have a Miasma Well, That would be kind of annoying because the two things, my things would die right now and he doesn't yet. Very good. So now this thing survives another turn. So does this. Uh, let's see. I want to keep on to that rumble. Ragged Wolf does kill this this turn. And that's that's killing this without a Witch Doctor behind it. So we do want to do that. I'm going to sacrifice the better here. I don't think we need the better right now. I think I'm going to want to go with the Rat King. Rat King Ragged Wolf. Maybe double Ragged Wolf. I want to get this guy a huge attack number. So, oh no, he disconnected. Okay, I'm going to do my turn. And then I'm going to uh, hold on and try to wait for him to come back. Okay. So I'm going to go with the Ragged Wolf. And then I'm going to go with the Rat King. And you guys are going to take some damage from that. Okay, Rat King. Yeah, the rats are going to take some poison damage. Yes, he reconnected. Awesome. And we have an 8-8 dude now. And where do we put that? Uh, that wasn't the best way of doing this. Um, I guess we'll just put you like this. No, oh shoot, why did I do that? I forgot that. Now you're just going to die to poison. This guy's around everything and he's giving off massive poison damage. That was kind of weird. I was clicking all over the place there. Oh well, you're going to kill you. Let's hope he doesn't have a damning curse and I think we're... It's pretty good. Just, I'm just hoping he doesn't have a damage curse. Every turn he doesn't have a damage curse is so big for me. Yeah, there's another turn he doesn't have a damage curse. Mire curse. Okay, so you're just going to kill everything. <laughs> Fine by me. Right now you are a monster. And I will go ahead and sacrifice the rumble. Hopefully I get another creature I can play. I don't. I wanted to get enough so I can... Do I take out that idol right now? Yeah, why not? Here, you're gonna be at, um... Yeah, let's move you down, actually. Let's just deal damage to that. I'll deal some damage there. He needs a mass wall to get rid of this better. Actually, it wouldn't be a huge deal. Okay. So now... Another turn, we're going to hope he doesn't have a damage curse. Another turn, we hope he doesn't have a damage curse. I'm surprised he hasn't drawn one yet. We've gotten much... Uh, he got. He gets the damage curse. Okay. So sad. We finally lose our <laughs> our monster. Um, probably gonna have to use a veteran to kill this life stealer. Right. I think so. Sacrifice the Earthborn Mystic. Ooh, Crimson Bolt. I would like to use a Crimson Bolt all this turn. I would be able to destroy this idol this turn and all I need is like a ragged wolf uh, rumble to destroy this idol but nah nah I'm gonna get rid of this I'll get rid of that while I can I move you up do I take you down and take the poison damage no I'm gonna let you choose what you want to poison so I am going to just damage you one you can, you can choose what you want to poison I mean these three guys. This has magic armor, and he already has the infectious blight. He really needs a mask. Well, I don't think I don't think Blinky's ha had the best draw this, draws this game. In this matchup, he should be way ahead. And, uh, and me versus Poison Decay, but I don't think he's had the best draws. Like his damage curse came pretty late. Maybe I don't know. Maybe he's had some early damage curses. I'm not sure. He gets a harvester and a tribesman, so that's good defense. And he goes goes like that. Okay. 
So now, let's see. I think we want to take this out this turn so we can't like protect it anymore. So I'll go with the Crimson Bowl, and I think I'm going to stack for resources and play the Wetland Ranger. Now the question is, do I stack the Fang Bear or the Breaker? I want to keep that out, but I'm going to sacrifice the Breaker because Fang Bear is actually pretty good, I think, because it can break through to this one health idol with Relentless if I get like a couple like stack cards on it. So I'm going to keep the Breaker. I mean the fang, the fang bear. And this turn, I'm going to play the ranger and the crimson bull. So I'll play the crimson bull. I'll be able to destroy this. You're gonna die next turn. Oh well. I will go ahead and take this down. I already saw I played two uh, Meyer curses, so I don't have to be that worried about that. But I can't just let it go. It's still a pretty big deal. And you know what? We're gonna play the Fang Bear. Because in case we draw a rally. I like I like having the Rentless guy right there, right now. Because if we draw a rally, we're I mean we're probably gonna win. It's not like he has any humans on the field that we could put a witch doctor behind this turn. So Actually, though there's a human, but now we gotta get the relentless. And there's Rider so we can't win this turn. Okay. Now a rat king is good. But I'm going to sacrifice that at this point. Because we don't have a wild layout. Rumble. What are the chances of the rumble moving all three of these guys? What are the chances? This would have... This is definitely going to move. And this is going to have a one-third chance of moving at worst. A one-four chance of moving at worst. And then this would have... Um, one four chance of like staying on row. And let's say this move back there next to it. There's actually a very good chance we win. I'm gonna do it. GG. Alright, we win the first two matches of this series. Uh last one I remember we lost, but this time we win the first two, so we just need one more. We can, we're gonna go for the sweep of the aggro growth deck in the next uh, deck wars video. And um He's going to have to go to his last deck and try to win these last three matches, but I just need one more win. So, see you guys in the next video. Keep on scrolling, everybody, and subscribe and like the video. See ya.